why is investment banking so competitive? It's not. Peter Thiel, the co-founder of uh, PayPal and the first investor in Facebook, compared it to Alcatraz. When he worked in law, which is very similar to investment banking, he said it's very easy to get in, impossible to get out. And I believe this is the case. You know, it, you can apply for a job, get a job, but once you get in, it's like it's like all hell. And what happens is is that people look into these jobs because there's excess supply. So the demand looks like it's very, very tight and competitive, so they make it seem like it's more than it is. It doesn't require much skill to be a banker. There's, a, there's some simple math, obviously there's some presentation skills, you have to put yourself together and you have to be intelligent. But really that's applicable to any job or career. So don't think that it's something unique. They uh, have a very high churn model, they're very easy to be re replaced. Uh, investment banking, while it's an important area, it's not very diverse. And a lot of people that I worked with in investment banking weren't in the fields of finance or economics, so they didn't have the fundamentals down. They just learned it on the job, maybe six to eight weeks worth of training. So the industry is competitive because it has high pay, very small teams, they have huge fees, and it's a very promising career if you want to work in a specific ind industry in some cases. But in most cases, people get burned out, they look for new industries, and at the current moment, banking is having a really hard time justifying their, one, their career path, you know, working 100 hours a week. We saw these in recent presentations. And then obviously, there's much more lucrative career opportunities in the world of technology and other industries that are just more exciting. They have more opportunity. They have a better recruiting path, better lifestyle, all of the above. And sometimes they have more equal pay. So it just doesn't make that much sense. And in other industries, you require much more hard skills, maybe in the world of engineering, programming, technology. And in banking, you only need to learn how to build models, which most of the computers do for you today. It's really relationship-driven. It's great if you want to do it, you should do it. But if you're doing it for the money, it's the wrong reason. So move ahead, let other people do it because they love it. Go find something that you love and you want to chase. Don't do investment banking because it's competitive. Do it because you love it.